What's going on everybody? Tyler with Clean Cut Lines. Today I want to talk to you about the Echo Red Armor Challenge and do a little review on the Steel FS-130. So you guys who follow my channel at all know that I'm in the Echo UAG program and they asked for some of us to do the Red Armor Challenge. And me personally, I've never ran Red Armor in anything. Um, so they sent us some to start running in our equipment and some I have a couple other friends and buddies and other people I know in lawn care that I'm going to give some to um, to also do the challenge. Maybe not as in depth as I'm trying to do mine but to see if they can tell any difference in their equipment and how well it's running. Um, so I'm going to do this challenge with a Steel FS-130 um, and I'm going to try to put some pictures up right here. I don't know if I can or not, but I'll try to put some pictures of like the spark plug and the uh, and some other things on there to see how gummed up they are. But anyway, so I have right here the steel FS-130. And this particular trimmer is about three years old. And when I was in the mountains, I did a whole lot of trimming with it on the side of mountains banks i mean i use that i put more hours on a trimmer it seemed like than i did a a mower um i believe if i remember correctly it is right at 399.99 price tag has a little over 30 cc's and the only maintenance thing that i've ever done to this trimmer is change the air filter and it got so gummed up that the thing wouldn't even run so I changed it out and it fired right back up. Um, it's got plenty of power. It's knocked down saplings about the size of my thumb. Uh, and like I said, it's going on three years and hadn't really had many issues. Now with it being three years old and you can tell just by looking at it how tired it's getting or how worn out it's getting, um, it is getting hard to crank. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed. If you haven't been to this channel before, hit the like and subscribe button.